Hey guys, welcome to Vlogs with Fire. And as the name states, it is Vlogs with myself. So today I am going to be taking my wife's car in for an oil change. Well, it is not yet up for uh, service, but I per periodically like to um, change the oil on the vehicle, especially if it's been sitting for a while, as this one has. So as you can imagine, it is sitting so it is very dirty so what we'll do is we'll first start at the car wash go get the oil and the oil filter and then we will go straight through to the mechanic to change the oil for us so anyway let's and the scent of the day is this icy miyaki pulse of the night Let's start her up. So as you know that the oil of your vehicle is actually one of the most important things to constantly make sure that it's fresh, it's changed because your engine relies on the oil to run smoothly. So anyway, it's been five years since we bought this vehicle and so far I can say that these N54 engines are very reliable because they are only, I'd say the only two major issues that we've had was um, okay, recently was the, the water pump, apparently the water pump in these cars is a bit of an issue and the injectors of course. So once those two issues were sorted, quite costly because there were six of them it's a uh, manual so the upside of, of, of that I'll say having this car in the manual is if you are a spirited driver you like to you like to maybe go on the twisty roads and maybe even go sideways every now and then then the manual is definitely I would recommend you go with it for the manual, the manual route. But if you are someone who likes to go fast, straight, then the DCT. It is definitely the the DCT gearbox is uh, the way to go. Anyway, we are still on route to get the oil sorted. So yeah, let's. Okay, so we just got the oil. Uh, here we go in the box with the oil filter here So this car takes 6.6 .6 liters of oil uh, Which the cost was so it was 600 rands for the oil and then for the filter it was 200 so it was about 800 of which I feel that it is a very little money spent on the longevity of your of your engine. I mean, spending 800 rands just to change the oil so that your engine performs better and your car lives a longer life. So, the service schedule on these cars is every 30,000 Ks. And I, I, I feel that it's, it's, it's crazy. I mean, 30,000 with the same oil. Yeah. So what I normally do is change the oil at every 15,000 Ks of which now as you can see just spent, just spent 800 rands for the oil change. It's, it's not much to actually, that rather than spending thousands and thousands for an engine that is now broken down or given you problems, I mean spend 800. So with that said, our journey continues. Let's... Ok, 
okay so now we are at the car wash the car is driving smooth I don't know if it's just me or when you change the oil of a vehicle it just feels smoother but anyway we are now here the engine is good nicely cleaned and now we're getting the car washed and then we'll be going back home so yeah and we are back so the car is clean the oil is changed so that said remember to always make sure that all the liquids your antifreeze your coolants your oils are always basically just try and change them as often as possible because that will keep your car running smoother for longer and it will cut a lot of costs in future so with that said i will see you on the next one cheers